to Welcome. I'm doing a match from round five, the Magic Online Championship Championship Series, um, July 31st, 2011. Uh, the mocks. Uh, format is Legacy. I'm doing a Rita Rabbit versus Double Drain. Uh, double Drain, yeah. All right. And Rita Rabbit is a uh, Reed Duke, a Star City Games writer. All right. Double Drain looks like uh, playing Affinity. Uh, turn one Signal Pest. Reader Rabbit. Uh, Green's on Zenith. Uh, Dryad Arbor. Uh, he's been playing uh, No Bent or No Rug for a while now, so I suspect that's what he's playing. And here, turn three, Master of Ethereum, followed by Frogmite, or maybe it was the other way around. Doesn't matter, that's uh, a bunch of guys coming towards uh, Reader Rabbit next turn. Alright. He's going to need uh, some kind of defense here to really stay alive. Even if a Dillion click is not enough. Here's a Thopter, just playing artifacts to feed the Master of Ethereum. Oh, there's a Cranial Plating. Um, this is not looking good. That's uh, 20 power with the creatures coming at him. Is this game? Oh, it's even more. 18, 22. What's he got? There's a Vendillion Click. Can block the Signal Pest. Takes over. Oh, he he uh, targeted himself, uh, revealed a mental misstep. Blocks, still takes 13, which is non-trivial amount of life loss. All right, even if uh, here... Let's see, what can he draw that... <laughs> other than Energy Flux, he might not have any draws that would let him live here. There's a Goyf that blocks Frogmite. Noble Hierarch. The thing is, the Cranial Plating on the Thopter is lethal. It, unless he's got uh, Lightning Bolt, I guess. But but let, let's think. Uh, he could animate Igmoth Nexus, a swing with the Seat of the Synod, uh, swing, and then only equip in response to um, a Bolt. That way he doesn't get blown out. Uh, but, oh, he's casting something big. Oh, Jace the Mind Sculptor in the Affinity deck. <laughs> he's that good. Now, if this resolves, obviously Bounce the Goyf and game over, right? He draws three? I don't I don't think I agree with that. Bounce the Goyf, he only has one... One blocker. Well, it's an Ink Moth Nexus and Ornithopter, and I guess you equip the Ornithopter. Does he have the Lightning Bolt to stay alive? I think he's still swimming with the Frogmite. The uh, Goyf has to block the Master, and Frogmite is free damage, or he doesn't, or base, or rather, Rita Rabbit doesn't have to block with the Hierarch. So I think that's a slight misplay here. Does he have the Lightning Bolt on the Ornithopter? Yeah. All right. So blocks Master Vithyrum with the Goyf and takes no damage. Oh, he blocks with the Hierarch. So yeah, definitely. Sh I think he should have swung. Well, I guess in hindsight, if he so the frog might have just gets blocked, eaten by the goif. So never mind. Uh, not sure what he can still draw. I mean, one of his outs was his Jace, I guess, if he ran it. Uh, but that's game. Uh, stay tuned for game two. And we're back, uh, game two. Let's see what kind of uh, artifact hate Reader Rabbit might have. You know, I mean, he was also running no the natural order and combo, which could be fast enough with a slow start from Affinity, but oh, here's a Cranial Plating on turn one. It's dazed. And it, obviously you had to daze there, but it sets uh, Reed Rabbit back a turn. And Etch Champion, which is actually fairly problematic uh, because there's really no way to remove and it's very unlikely that he'll be able to get rid of all of Double Drain's artifacts to, or enough of Double Drain's artifacts to prevent Metalcraft. All right, uh, if he's got to follow up like another cranial plating, that could make that edge champion lethal very quickly. But nothing, and no no main one uh, play, so no master of Ethereum likely. And another edge champion, wow. Um, wow, I mean, it's creeping corrosion time here. <laughs> but I don't know if that card is seen play in Legacy now. All right, uh... Natural order. All right. There's Progenitus. 
Now the question is going to be: Is Progenit is going to be able to race these guys? Um, he can't block the champions, so any equipment or any significant pump uh, would make uh, his the, the affinity army much bigger. Here's a signal pass again. That's going to pump. Oh gosh, the guys. Let's all right. Let's see. Let's start doing some math in a second. So Edge Champion and Nexus are flying by. All right, 14 life. Can he? Can a Double Drain do 16, 14 damage next turn? All right, we have one, two, three, four, five creatures being pumped by the Signal Pest. So that's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I see 14 damage on the board, so uh, Reed Rab is going to have to play another creature to block at least one, uh, probably the Mirror Enforcer, in order to stay alive. There's a Hierarch. That Hierarch is enough to uh, block an Enforcer and win the race. The question is, does Double Drain have something like uh, uh, Dispatch or, or Play Adjacent, Bounce Your Guy? And Tarmogoyf. Oh, that probably seals the deal as he can block Memnite and Mirror Enforcer. And that's game. All right, we're off to game two. Two very explosive decks. Uh, winning games pretty quickly and decisively. Okay, and we're here for the last uh, game of this match. Uh, seems like going first is pretty critical. I mean, I think he, uh, had uh, Double Drain gone first that last game, he might have gotten an extra swing first that would have tipped the race in his favor. But here's a, another s very fast start with the turn one Mem Knight signal pest spring leaf drum. Um, Volcanic Island. I guess uh, he has. Uh, Reader Rabbit has a wrath in the form of Fire Spout, but depending on how fast uh, Double Drains... Oh! No turn to play. That's pretty telling. That means he doesn't have a 2-drop. Um, so he probably has Etch Champions in hand. I think he would have... Or he's playing... Maybe he might be playing around days if he had a 2-drop. But anyway, uh, Lightning Bolt takes out Signal Pest. And... Still no turn to play. Uh, don't think uh, Double Drain can afford to wait much longer. Uh, there's a Dryad Arbor. If he's if Reader Rabbit has a natural oh Ancient Grudge, that's going to mop this game up. Uh, taking out all the key artifacts while the Goyf uh, goes to town. All right, and Etch Champion. But no, not as huge a threat when Tarmogoyf is on the other side of the field. And depending on the amount of uh, Ancient Grudges available, or, you know, if he's got another sort of uh, uh, removal spell, uh, he can take out enough artifacts to uh, disable the Metalcraft and the protection on the Ench Champion. Oh, and there's Natural Order. Um, so that's going to do it. There's a Plating. All right. What's going on here? Okay, and there's the Ancient Grudge on the Cranial Plating. So, no fast beats, and now he just eats 15? Yeah. Go to 1, and does he have the Bolt? There's the Bolt. That's game, folks. Uh, lightning quick matches, uh, explosive decks, but uh, Natural Order, uh, or No Rug, takes it down. Uh, but it's still, like, it was close. I think... Uh, uh, Double Drain hadn't stumbled a little bit on his mana early. He might have been able to do a little bit more. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next round. One, two.